Hey guys, welcome to Tiger Tropics. Today, trying out a little experiment. Now, trying to reduce nitrates and phosphates can be very difficult, especially when, when you're doing your weekly water changes using tap water. You're, you're sort of importing more uh, nitrates in um, and kind of, kind of replenishing them. So, it's very difficult to get a low level. So, you need things in the tank, i.e. plants, sort of draw some of that including your biomedia so what i've done is i found a lady on facebook who was sending some pofos which are supposed to be very good um for nitrate reduction these things i'm going to basically try mounting them up and put them in the tank and i've also got some lilies as well that are going to go in there and I'm just going to show you how I've basically, um, how I'm doing the mounting of it. Okay, so as you can see, I've got the plants here. So what I'm going to do is gather them together, like so. And then, cable tie. So through, let's get that bit wrong, that way. weird when you try to do it via the uh, the screen here we go Let's pass them through don't do them too tight you don't want to end up strangling them to roughly where you want them that was uh right so basically i'm going to pass this through here because the hook here is going to be on the on the edge of the glass. And that's pretty much it. So basically this this little hook here is a bungee hook. Buy them from B and Q, like hardware stores, and this is literally going to hook on the edge of the glass. And all of these are going to go into the water. This biorite should grow. As it grows, it'll be pulling nitrates and phosphates out of the water. Okay, as you can see, hook just on the edge there, and then that's it. They're mounted. If you look in here. A big bundle of uh, roots. Just try to basically get them to hang down. Pretty sure they look at. Pretty sure the fish are going to have something to do with that. Basically, give it time, sort itself out, and in theory, they'll grow down, then roots will become thicker, and the plant will start to grow. When it grows, it should grow across here, because we've got the light here, and the nutrients in the water. Okay, with this, there's a piece of lily. Yep, piece of lily. Um... Got to take it out of the soil and then wash the uh, the roots. Okay, so I pulled them out of the uh, soil and literally the whole pot was just like one big root. So in here is um, dechlorinated water. So just going to try to get much of the soil off because I don't want that in the tank. All I want is the plant and the roots. Okay, so like before, put these little hooks on, and I'm going to stick that on the edge there. So I've got to sort out the uh, the pickup on the uh, on the filter. 
but then I'll line the rest of them up here there you go I've lined them up try to make sure that these leaves don't go in the water because um, what we are going to find is that there's going to be some um, some rotting on on those uh, roots before the, 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 the plant sort of takes off again um, but the idea being is that they'll start absorbing nutrients and whatnot in the tank and I'll know that it's doing well when these start to pick up um, and yeah we'll basically have these roots growing growing down the plants will be growing up the uh, this plant here will basically encompass this this whole section here and the pofos will basically grow across here like this which will look nice but the idea is is these fish are going to get bigger and the bigger they get the more poo and all the rest of it they're going to do and hide nitrates and all the rest of it so these are sort of like natural filtration for for them two elements um, what I'll do is I'll, I'll, I'll do a water uh, test, see where the nitrates are at the moment. So in a month's time, I can basically compare it and see um, if it's actually made any difference. And I'll keep you posted on um, how the plants are actually doing. Yeah guys, so that's a quick little how-to on um, starting up a little plant filtration system for your tank. And um, if there's anything that sort of st sticks out, you know, that I think, you know, might me be messed up or whatever, um, I'll basically do a little short video and let you guys know. So thanks very much. Like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, see you next time.